Welcome to basic core activation. Go ahead and come onto your yoga mat and we're going to get started on our hands and knees. So take a few moments to get centered, relaxing your body. Go and just place your hands on the tops of your knees and relax your shoulders. Begin to notice your breath, your gentle inhalation and your exhalation. Feel as your chest rises and falls. Breathing in and breathing out. On the next inhalation, take your arms overhead and press your palms to the sky. Stretching through the arms and the spine. Exhale, bring your hands back down to your sides. And then again, inhaling your arms overhead. Big breath in, exhale, arms up. And go ahead and twist over to the right. Taking your right arm behind you and your left arm in front of you. Breathe. Continue expanding through your spine. And then on the next inhale, bring your arms back up overhead and exhale over to the left. Right arm out in front of you and your left arm behind you. Twisting from the bottom of the spine up towards the head. And then on your next inhalation, go ahead and bring your arms back up and overhead. Big breath in. And then exhale your arms down to your sides. You're going to come around onto your hands and knees, walking your hands under your shoulders and your knees underneath your hips. Bring your inner thighs together and start to bring your awareness to your core. We're going to exhale and round our back, coming into cat pose. And then as you inhale, drop your belly down and come into cow, exhaling into cat and inhaling into cow. Exhale, round your tailbone under. Press the ground away from you. Get a nice stretch in your upper back. And maybe even hold it if that feels good to you. And then drop the belly down, lifting the sit bones and the tailbone up and the head up. Go ahead and come back to a flat back. Again, activate your core. Bring your inner thighs together. And I'm going to have you bring your right leg straight back, pointing the toes. Take a slight internal rotation of that back leg so that the top of the knee is pointing straight down to the mat. Now on the next inhale, you're going to reach out with your left arm. And then inhale, come on down. Exhale, you're going to switch sides. And then inhale, reach your left leg straight back. Turn that leg so that the center of the knee points down to the ground. And then reach your right arm out in front of you. Finding your balance, finding a focal point down on the ground in front of you and release down. Go ahead and take a big breath in, get ready. We're gonna shift our hands one hand length forward. We're gonna shift our shoulders over the hands, tuck the toes under and exhale back into downward facing dog. Go ahead and shimmy the legs, walking the feet, bending the knees, opening up the spine, opening up the backs of the legs. Feel free to bend one knee or the other and stretching the opposite heel down to the ground. Getting a nice stretch in the back side of your body. Lift the sit bones up and lengthen the spine. I'm gonna have you shift forward, inhale forward into plank pose. Tuck your tailbone under, draw your core in. Find a nice tight core here. Shift forward to the tippy tops of your toes and then exhale back to down dog. Breathe, exhale, let your body Open up and relax into this position. Press the heels down to the floor. Let's open up the palms. And we're gonna shift forward again into plank pose. And again, exhale back to downward facing dog. Palms press into the ground, lengthen your spine. On the next inhale, take your right leg up to the sky. Lengthen the leg up, heel to the sky, toes to the sky. Go ahead and bend that right knee, bring the heel to the rear. And then straighten the leg and extend the leg as high as you can up into the sky. Pressing into the palms, lengthening the right side of your body, opening up that leg. And now go ahead and draw that leg forward on an exhale. You're going to bring it up and over towards your left elbow and extend the leg back up into the sky. And then take the leg down to the ground, downward facing dog. 
Now take an inhale, left leg up to the sky. We're doing the same thing here on this side of the body, bending the knee, bring the heel to the rear, lift the knee to the sky, and straighten the leg, lengthen the side of the body, extending through the left leg as high as you can. Once again, bend the knee. Come back into the neutral position, shift forward into plank, draw that knee up and over towards the right elbow, and then inhale, take it up to the sky, and exhale back to down dog. Now we're going to inhale down to our knees. We're going to open the knees wide, bring the toes together, and press down into child's pose. Extend your arms out in front of you, relaxing your forehead on the floor. Take the elbows off the mat and reach your arms out as far as you can in front of you, getting a nice stretch in your upper back, your upper body, your armpits, the sides. Now we're going to take an inhale. We're going to walk the hands over to the right, keeping the head in between the arms and just getting a good stretch in the left side of your body. Go ahead and breathe deep, lengthen out, press your sit bones down, and then inhale, walk your hands back to the center, and exhale, relax. Inhale, lengthen again, we're going to walk the hands over to the left, extending through the right side of the body. Press the heels and the sit bones together, reaching the arms out as far as you can. And then inhale, walk the hands back to the center, and relax, exhale down, child's pose, forehead to the mat. Take a big breath and inhale, come back up to tabletop. I'm going to have you walk back and just take a moment to sit in Virasana. You sit on your heels, lengthen the quadriceps. And take a moment to check in with your breath and your body. And then go ahead and shift your legs around in front of you. And I'm going to have you roll down onto your back. And go ahead and hug your knees into your chest. They say we need about 10 hugs a day. So here this counts as one of them. Go ahead and keep hugging those knees into your chest, lengthening the backside of your body, and relaxing and elongating your spine. Go and take your arms out to the sides, making a T with your arms. Extend your legs straight up into the sky, flexing the feet, pressing the heel to the sky, drawing the toes toward your nose. On the next inhale, pull the navel down to the spine and exhale, lower the right leg down. Inhale it up and switch and lower the left leg down. On every inhale, you're going to draw the navel down and you're going to exhale the leg down to the floor. Exhale down, inhale up. Exhale down, inhale up. If you'd like to make this a little bit more advanced, bring your head and arms up, pointing the fingers down towards your bottom of the yoga mat, squeezing your core, exhaling the legs down and inhaling them up. Go ahead and keep doing this, and then when you're all done, you feel it, go ahead and hug your knees into your chest. Take a moment to relax. And now go ahead and just let the knees drop over to the left, relaxing the abdomen, opening up the right side of the body. Look over towards the right hand, and just relax, opening up, allowing your body to do a gentle twist here. Go ahead and inhale, lift the knees back up. And then allow the legs to drop over to the right. Gentle twist, opening up the left side of your body. And then go ahead and look over towards the left hand, allowing the body to just gently twist and open up here. Draw the knees back up. And I'm going to have you take your right leg, cross it up and over the left leg. And you're going to lift your hips up and over to the right. And then we're going to drop the knees over to the left. Coming into a nice twist here. And then look over towards your right hand. Allow the body to lengthen. Try to bring that right shoulder down to the floor. Grounding down through both shoulders. Go ahead and bring your head back up to a neutral position. Bring your legs back up. Walk your hips underneath you. Coming into a neutral position. And then we're going to take the left foot, lift it up, and cross it over the right leg. We're going to walk the feet over to the left, walk the hips over to the left, and we're going to allow the knees to now drop over to the right. Coming into a twist on this side of our body now. And then relaxing, looking over towards your left hand. This is a great way to release your spine, to help your body with the digestion process, And rid your body of toxins. Go ahead and inhale the legs back up. 
unravel the legs, hug your knees into your chest, and go ahead and just begin to relax. Bring your awareness back to your breathing, and just hug your knees into your chest. Draw your head up and your fingers towards your heels. Give yourself a little hug, and I'm going to have you extend your heels out and your arms overhead, and we're going to do a couple core moves here, extending the legs out, inhaling the arms overhead, and exhale, extension, inhale, bring the legs back in. Exhale, extend, inhale, exhale, extend, inhale, bring the legs back in, and give yourself a hug one last time. And just go ahead and put the feet down to the floor and take a moment to relax. Notice your core, how it feels. Notice your body and your breath. Take a couple of breaths here and get ready to move on with your day. Bringing your awareness back to the mat beneath you and allowing your body to relax. Let this process invigorate you and open you up. Go ahead and relax now and just take a couple deep breaths. Allowing the body to release and relax. Relax. 